Hi everyone, it's me. So this week we are back. Everybody screamed at me to do another Drink This video. So here we are. Last time I did a Drink This Gin video and I sat far back so you could see like all the bottles and the cups and stuff and I thought it would look cool, but it felt like I was just really far away from the camera. So I've scooched up. I'm gonna sit right in front of you like I normally do. So you can't see the bottles, but they are here. Quick side note, Kent is in the middle of a heat wave. I am sweating. I am sweating. So if you see me like actively sweat during this video, please just ignore it, okay? I'm very sweaty. Now the idea that I'm gonna go with is we are going to do a taste test of four different whiskeys. Now these were very lovingly donated to me, thank God. That's why they're half empty bottles, <laughs> basically. Then I'm going to restart the camera and I'm going to film a Patreon video of another whiskey related video. So I'm hoping that one will be very funny because I'll be four drinks deep at that time and I'm, then I'm gonna drink more whiskey. So if you do wanna watch that video or you wanna watch more of my content, I post a new video on Patreon every week. This is my one plug for the whole video. I won't say it again, that's it. So without further ado, let's go. Now, I have four whiskeys here that you can't see, but trust me, they are here. Anywho, the other thing I wanted to mention, the last, uh, the gin video I did, everybody said that I was wasted at the beginning of that and I must have done that video multiple times. That's not true. I never do videos more than once, <laughs> ever, never, ever. So that was just me. Just me painfully sober. And I'm also very much sober now, okay? I can't believe I have to tell people that. I haven't been drinking, but I have been sweating. Let's carry on. I think the first one I wanna start with is Johnny Walker Green Label. Now, this one I've actually had before. I like this a lot. I like to make old fashions, uh, whiskey-based old fashions with Johnny Walker Green Label. So I figure let's start with this one because I know it and I like it and I can use that to compare. Now it smells like whiskey. Also for people who don't know me and have just stumbled upon a whiskey tasting video, I want you to know right now, I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Thank you. We're just gonna do one shot of each because I got stuff to do later and I got a Patreon video that I also need to record. There we go. Okay, we got some dirty glasses, <laughs> ice, and Johnny Walker Green Label. Cheers. Hello, all right. What does it taste like? Honestly, I couldn't tell you. <laughs> I could not tell you. I don't know, I just find that I really like this. I really like this one. Can you see? It's a beautiful color. I don't know if color makes a difference, does it? Maybe. I just think it tastes real nice and it's very, it's very smooth. It certainly burns all the way going down. Good one, Mr. Walker. Fantastic. I'm gonna give Johnny Walker Green Label Blended Malt Scotch Whiskey, product of Scotland, five out of five Scots. I think it's fantastic. Next up, I wanted to do a Shackleton Blended Malt Scotch Whiskey. I know it's not the same as the first one. Guess what? I don't care. If the guy revving his motorcycle outside my house could move, that would be fantastic. We have to just wait till he goes because he's super loud. I'm not sure if it's getting picked up on the camera, but I can hear it. All right, he's far enough away. Anywho, Shackleton's I thought was such a cool bottle. It's, the bottle itself is like a really light blue and then it's got um, on the front, based on an antique blend of 
McKinley's Rare Old Highland Malt Whiskey, the spirit supplied to the 1907 British Antarctic Expedition. How cool. I love it. I love, I love everything. Okay, even on the back it says, I believe it is in our nature to explore, to reach out into the unknown. Ernest Shackleton. I almost said Everest. It's not Everest. It's Ernest. Nice. So Shackleton is a, what did I say? A blended malt scotch whiskey. Does that mean much to me? Not really. Oh, I'm so sweaty. Okay, here's the Shackleton's. It's, so this is, can you tell the different colors? This one is almost identical. I don't know what I'm saying. Cheers. Now Shackleton's taste, Shackleton's tastes almost more watered down. Watered down is probably not a good word that I want to say. The uh, green label is such a strong, powerful, painful taste. Shackleton's is less so, but that doesn't mean it's bad. Yeah, that's actually, that's, it's very pleasant. If you don't like the burning sensation of certain uh, whiskeys, this definitely has way less of a sensation. That's not right. I'm going to give the Shackleton uh, blended malt, oh wait, is that the same? I thought they were different. Blended malt scotch whiskey, blended malt scotch whiskey. Hey, they're the same. Fantastic. People can get mad at me for other reasons. I'm going to give the Shackleton, I'm going to say a six out of seven. It's a way less intense taste, so it's not as painful, if that makes sense. Nice. I'm so sweaty right now. I don't know what to do with myself. <sighs> Next up, I thought we would do a Johnny Walker Black Label. Now, I was going to start buying this because it is the cheaper version of the green label. Green's a bit expensive. I'm on a budget, so I was going to start getting into this stuff. It is also a blended scotch whiskey, although it's not malt, is it? So this says blended malt scotch whiskey. This says blended scotch whiskey. What's the difference? You tell me. All right, color, guess what? Looks exactly the same. <laughs> I don't, I watched this video on YouTube a while back and it was like, um, I think she was a whiskey es expert, maybe or a scotch ex, I don't know. And she was sampling whiskeys or whatever it was blind and then saying like the profile, the taste profile and whether she thought it was expensive or how it was uh, like made and whether it was blended or not and stuff. It's like, that's insane that you can do that. All of these pretty much taste the same to me. So cheers. Okay, black label tastes very similar to green label, but I want to say it doesn't taste as heavy. Maybe that's my brain just taking into account that I know that it's cheaper, but black label, no, green label tastes I'm starting to eat my own hair. This is very strong. This is very similar, but not as strong. I'm not sure. I'm gonna give the Johnny Walker Black Label four out of six blackness. Black flags, black labels. You, you decide. It's nice, but I wanna say it's not as good as the green label, but I don't know if that's just me because I know that it's cheaper. You know what I mean? I don't know if that's a, plus it's got a screw tap screw cap. You know, it's not, it's not the same. Whew. 
Okay, finally we have a Laphroaig uh, single malt scotch whiskey, 10 years. Yay! The most richly flavored of all scotch whiskeys, established in 1815. Now I'm pretty sure my dad drinks Laphroaig. Oh, a different noise. I can't begin to tell you how sweaty I am right now. I hope you can't tell. Here's to Laphroaig, 10 years, whatever I just said. Cheers. Oh, hello. Why is that so different? Oh my God. Ooh, ooh, uh, ooh, that's not nice. Why don't I like that? I don't like that at all. Oh. <laughs> Lafroig, I am not happy with you. Oh, buddy, old pal. Oh, buddy, old pal. I don't like that. Very peaty. Very peaty, very smoky, but I don't, I don't like this one at all. It makes my mouth upset. I'm gonna give Laphroaig one out of five peats. It's not for me. Oh, why? Oh, that's better. Oh, oh. So the final question is. How do these compare against each other? That's a good question. I gotta say, we all know the worst one. Why? Why would you do this to yourself? I still have memories of it. No, thank you. Then, now the last three, I actually like all of them, to be honest. Um... Let me think on this for a second. Okay. I gotta say, after much deliberation, Shackleton's comes next. It's um, a less of a taste, tastes almost like watered down a little bit, but it's not bad. It's definitely not bad. And if I was drinking it on its own or I was putting it into a cocktail, I would be more than happy to use this. But compared to the other stuff, it is in a third. Then we're gonna go Black Label. I like Johnny Walker a lot. This is the lesser of the, of the labels. <laughs> and the top one is our boy, Green Label. This just has such a nice taste to it. And I really, really like it. Okay, so sue me. It's fantastic. Now we're gonna put these down real gently. Real gently, you guys. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Gentle, gentle. Fantastic. So those are my ranked uh, whiskeys, blended combination. Some are, some are not, and some are. I. Sometimes people get really upset when I don't compare the same thing. And to those people, I think, buddy, life is short. Drink what you want, compare what you want, record and film what you want. I guess now I, I'm gonna go wash my face because I am coated in a thin layer of sweat. And then I'm gonna film my Patreon video with these guys, not this one. Oh, I guess, oh, I have to use that one. Ugh, with all of them. I'm gonna film another one with all of them. Wish me luck. If you wanna watch that stuff, you know where to go. I won't say it again. And that's, this video felt really short. Did I miss something or am I just lost track of time? As always, thank you guys so much for watching and until next time, bye. And if anyone wants to buy me a birthday present, you know what to get me. Oh, it's cold. <laughs>